I'm encouraged by the progress that we have made between Australia and China's relationship in producing stabilisation to the benefit of both of our nations and with the objective of advancing uh, peace and security in the region. China will resume imports of Australian lobster by year-end, Prime Minister Anthony Albanese said on Thursday, October 10, marking the end of a four-year diplomatic fight that saw tens of billions of dollars of Australian exports locked out of China. Albanese said he agreed on the timeline to resume full lobster trade by year-end during a meeting with Chinese Premier Li Chang on the sidelines of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations meeting in Laos. I'm pleased to announce that Premier Li and I have agreed on a timetable to resume full lobster trade by the end of this year. This, of course, will be in time for Chinese New Year, and this will be welcomed by the uh, people engaged in the live lobster industry. China first imposed unofficial bans and tariffs on Australian goods ranging from coal to wine and rock lobster in late 2020 after years of tensions that culminated in Canberra calling for an inquiry into the origins of COVID-19. Before Thursday's announcement, all the restrictions bar lobster had been removed as relations between the major trading partners improved.